Paul, just when you think there isn't a cause that hasn't been manipulated by the woke, along comes PLM. Yes, that is correct. Not BLM, but PLM. You won't believe it. Pigeon Lives Matter. And it's even got its own Facebook page. Its leader is an Adelaide woman, Samira Fateh, who has 60 rescue pigeons living in her home. Helping me make sense of this nonsense is James Ashby from One Nation and Christy McSweeney, Managing Director of the PR Council. Welcome to the show, team. G'day. Thanks for having me. Now, James, Pigeon Lives Matter. You would think it was a joke, but, but this is actually a legit thing. Uh, this woman uh, took issue with uh, culling of pigeons in Victoria Square in the middle of the Adelaide CBD, and she's apparently now harbouring these birds in her house. The, the local health authorities have gone around and said this, this joint is not fit for any human to inhabit, and she's arguing the point. Pigeon lives matter, seriously. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. <laughs> do you remember that from Mary Poppins? Yes, I That's do. precisely what that image conjures up, this, this oh, God. pigeon lady standing out there <laughs> feeding pigeons. But, look, they are a disgraceful creature, to be quite honest. Oh. I was always raised to believe they were rats with, with wings. Dead so right. uh, they are. They carry vermin. They stink. The last thing you want is to have these things in your house. I had an aunt that cared for... Uh, injured uh, bats, and I always used Ugh. to say to her, you know, the best and kindest thing you can do is hit them over the head with a brick <laughs> as well. So I don't understand these people that like to bring stinky, horrible vermin into their household. So, no, I, I'd be saying from a health side of things, get rid of them as well. I've got to tell you, the creatures behind you on that wall, the horses, they are much better than pigeons. And if anyone fancies uh, sure losing are. a couple of dollars tomorrow, I've got a horse running around at Yarra Valley in race five called El Campion. But don't come complaining to me if you do your dough.